Well, welcome to Beyond Cinema magazine at the AFCI Lounge in Cannes with Silvio Maselli, um, the CEO of the Apulia Film Commission Foundation. Um, firstly, like, I like to know where people started. What job was? What do, job did you have before you took on this role with the Film Commission? Yeah, this is a good question. Thank you, because it depends by the life everybody has the fortune to live. But in my case, I studied political sciences, and after that, I had a master or one here, and I lived six months in London. And after that, I became I started to I started to, to uh, occupy myself with cinema, and I was involved in uh, as assistant of the general director at Fandango, which is um, one of the most important independent production companies in Italy and the place in, in which definitely I've learned everything I, today I, I know about this world. And, and so when they asked you or when you applied for the job to take on this role, what did you think was going to be the biggest challenge? Well, to me the biggest challenge for a film commissioner is to be convinced that the best way to do this job in a good way is to do like, in, in, in a way quite similar, uh, uh, such as your work with the work, of, the work of the producer. If you do the same thing that the producer has to do in its own job, well, this is a good way to, to make a film commission. Because I, I, I really believe that uh, a, film commissioner, a film commissioner has to speak the same language of a producer. So producers and film commissioners are, are the same thing because they want the same things. And, uh, and so, what, so when you started out, what was the first thing that you tried to set in place to try and achieve? Well, I think that the first thing, the most important thing is to well communicate what you are doing. Because without communication, your work doesn't exist. And so I'm, I'm, my, my first achievement was, was this trying to communicate in, in a very good shape what, what we are uh, we, we were doing uh, at the time. And is, do you see your role as much to, to promote local filmmakers as much to attract foreign production or really is it about attracting foreign foreign projects into Apulia? Well I, I don't believe in cinetourism so I think that mm, film commissioning and film funding are have, have to be uh, focused on the possibility to increase the local development. And so I, I think that uh, our aim, in the case of Puglia, of my region, is to attract the more productions we can. And the more productions we can attract, the more they will spread our image uh, abroad or in our country. Uh, actually, we are very, very interested in attracting international producers with a new financial instrument that today we are announcing, we are launching here in Cannes. So you're la launching this, this, these incentives and other things and it's not just the normal Italian incentives but an additional offering as well. Yeah, it is. It is definitely. We, we have thought about a new, no, not so Italian instrument because it is a public tender and uh, it is a rebate uh, of 15% of the uh, expenses, the producing expenses in our region uh, below the line and uh, we are able to add this 15% to the 25% of Italian tax credit forecasted by our minister. Wonderful. So, uh, fifteen percent added to twenty five percent and to that that producers can save uh, with a joint uh, an agreement joined but from from abroad with Italian co producers or line producers uh, will be create a, a sixty one percent of savings in our region that is definitely a good a good news for producers what what other um, entities like whether it's another country or another also regional area did you look at to compare yourselves to well international means international but we are focused in this moment to United States UK Germany France 
uh, Brazil and India because in the last three years we have attracted lots of Indian movies uh, in some cases we, we attracted uh, very very important and popular Indian movies and we believe that uh, from India, from Brazil, from these new countries uh, we will be very able to attract new stories because I think, I feel that actually the, the problem in our world, in our business world, is that we have not so new stories and we believe that a good work made by a film commissioner is uh, always to attract good stories. And, I mean, obviously, Ozpetek filmed in Apulia. You had The Woman with uh, Willem Dafoe film in the region as well. Is there a specific film that has filmed partly or entirely in Apulia yeah. that is your personal favorite? Well, I mean, yes, because it's, you know, it's simple. But I think that we are not so... Uh, obsessed by the idea that you have to shoot your movie in our region and to say to your audience that that movie is shooted, uh, is shot. Sorry, in in our region. No, it's not so important. Yeah. Uh, we are very. We, we love to um, create good occasions for our employers and to create public develop uh, local development. This is our aim and this is definitely what we have to do. And the fund that you guys have as well, is that uh, what kind of projects have you already put in place for 2012, 2013? Well, actually we have a lot of Italian movies and European movies, but uh, with the, this new fund, international fund, we are hoping that uh, some international producers coming from abroad and for other countries different from Europe uh, will be attracted and will be, you know, satisfied by our new financial instrument. And so we are hoping and we are working on. And of all the movies that have shot in Apulia, which do you think, like, which is your personal favorite film that has used Apulia as a location? Well, the best in these last years, surely, has been the loose cannons by first and Ospatek. And, and considering the, the work made by uh, my colleagues, my film commissioner colleagues, I think that the best movie ever made in a, in a country and in a territory with the aim of the local film commission and the local fans has been the In Bruges. Uh, a very, very nice movie and a, a very clever operation for, for attracting and, and for you know, to increase the image of a place uh, through the movie. Very cool. Well, congratulations on all this new movement that you're seeing coming to your region. And uh, we look forward to seeing what comes out of it in the next couple of years.